Hey guys. <laughs> All right, let's paint something. Okay, so this is Kenny Ray's painting. We gave this away on the last stream. Uh, I've been gone on vacation. No, not really on vacation, on a trip. When you're retired, you don't take vacations. You just go on trips. <laughs> anyway, so let's get, let's do a painting. This is Kenny Ray's painting, though, that he got in the, he won in the last, uh, last, uh, video. Let me get the monitor up here and we'll be ready to go. I think maybe we'll do a little seascape today. You know me, I get started, you never tell what the heck's level to show up here. And we just go wherever the painting wants to go. Alright. So shout out to Kenny Ray. I got this thing signed, Kenny. So as soon as it, as soon as it dries, we'll get it out to you. So it was a great trip to Florida. We had a good time. Let's start off with some liquid white. So at least we'll know we're going to be doing that much, right? Here's some liquid white over here. Let's just use this. Goodness gracious. Hang on, guys. I'm a little discombobulated after being down in Florida. Maybe then. Alright. But anyway, came off the beach three days ago now. And uh, came home to snow. Lovely. <laughs> Wasn't my exactly my idea. The best homecoming I could have had, but it could have been nice and warm, ready for me to put the garden in, but but it wasn't. So let's get this liquid white. I'll stir it up here a little bit. This is just Bob Ross liquid white. Emily Jean, hello darling. It looks pretty already. <laughs> hey Pat. Hey Anthony. Hey Dorothy. Hey Andy. I'm still a little discombobulated here. I thought I was ready, but I reckon I wasn't. So let me get some. Let me get some thinner poured up here. Using my handy new jar. I don't think you can see that on the camera, but I had a great time on the beach. Missed all you guys, but here, but I'm back now. So now you got me till spring, and the garden has to go in. Then I'll be I'll be wandering off to the garden for a little while. But we're just putting some. Thin coat of liquid white on here just to allow the colors to blend. <laughs> Emily Jean, I was showing your art off. And yours too, Anthony, down in Florida. Like, hey. <laughs> Look at this art. Everybody was like, ooh. I wish y'all could have heard all the ooh-ahs. That was funny. But anyway, I was down there visiting with my mom. She'll be home sometime in March. I think she's coming home the second week of March. Goes down the first week of January and comes back the first week of March. I think that's right. Anyway, it was good to see her. All right. Now we're just going to see if that's too much or too little. So let's take our fingertips and just take a couple of touches. That's kind of like what we're looking for. We don't want the fingerprints to be solid white. So let me just wipe my fingers off. Hey, Gene. All right. Oh, you know what? For, hang on, guys. I forgot to share this out. My bad. Oh, I was supposed to go there and there and there. And there and there. Just sharing this out to a couple places in case people want to drop in. All right, 
So, so this is what it looked like when I came home. Everything's all white. I'm gonna say, white sand beaches of Destin were far preferable to the white snow on my driveway when I got home. <laughs> all right. So I'll tell you what we're gonna do today. I'm gonna try this little seascape idea I've had. Being on the beach. Never done much of a beach scene. So we'll see how it goes. I'm gonna be looking for some Payne's Gray. You guys use if you guys use Payne's Gray much, it's pretty cool. Good color. Not here talked about very much, but it's still a cool color. Hey Arbor! Put a bead of white down over there. We'll come back and see what else we need in a minute. We'll think about it. We'll think about it. We'll think about it. All right. Hey, Andy. I don't know. What's up? Just painting, I reckon. I've been working on... I don't know if you guys... Well, you can't see it today with the screen. Is, but I, I, I do a lot of uh, 19th century antique lamp restoration. And... Uh, then I donate this stuff to museums and stuff. So I've, I've been working on that since I've been home. Trying to get that trying to get that going. That might be. Alright. Well, I think we'll put this color on here and see how we like it. It might be a little too dark for what I'm thinking about. But if it is, we'll change it. Right? If it is, if we don't like it, we'll just change it. We mix up a lot of this color. Because I don't need really a lot of it, I don't think. I'm going to start off with the sky. We're going to do it a little differently than we usually do. I'm going to start at the bottom. I kind of want the... This part here is going to all kind of be A little different approach. A little different approach. Some gorgeous sunset pictures from down, down there at the beach. Photos. Darken this corner just a little bit. Maybe a little bit up here. Hey William, how are you doing today? It's kind of tapping some cloud movement in here. Alright, kind of happy with that. I reckon. So now I've got this paint's gray, and I think I'll select a little phthalo blue in with that together. Put the two of them together. And we'll just kind of just kind of lay the ocean in here. Probably not as straight as masking tape, taping it off, but it'll do. All right. And I just kind of want to let this fade in. Okay. white to that, a little bit of thalo blue. A 
Alright, now let's go back and do a little bit more on this guy. I'm going to blend some of that out. It's a little too verbose there. It's okay. Get another brush here. Just put a little bit of movement in the sky. I think it lose a strong color. It's not as strong as Prussian blue, but it's pretty strong. Yeah, let's see. You might still be a little bit too, a little bit too much. Let's try this. a little bit. I'm just adding some titanium white right here to the middle, just to lighten this just barely. Just enough. To... You know what? I tell you what. Let's take a little bit of. No. What is this? Hey, Bruce. I'll take a little bit of cad yellow. Anthony's been uh, put, kicking them out, man. He's been kicking the penguins out like crazy. If you guys haven't been watching his channel, you're missing out. You have to be watching it. All right, let's just put some. Put a little bit of surf out here with this. work. Let's wipe it off on a knife. I mean wipe it off on a paper towel. Let's see. Let's put a little more in here. Right about here. This bigger line. And then let's take some of this darker blue and put right under that just to create a little bit of shadow under this wave. There we go. You 
can't hear me. Bruce, can you can you guys hear me? All right, I'll wait till you guys say you can hear me. While I'm, while I'm waiting, I'll just straighten out this way over here. Can you hear me? Hello, hello. Nobody's answering, so I guess it can't hear me. Can you guys hear me? No? Going once, going twice. All right, that's about That's Thank you. All right, now we gotta put the camera back. All right, so let's see. We wanna put in some beach stuff. So let's do some beach stuff. Let's start off with a little bit of darker color. Maybe a couple different darker colors. So we'll take some midnight brown, some dark sienna. A new dark sienna tomorrow. That's good. That'd be fun. All right, let's just kind of lay this dark, darker color in here a little bit. So let's see. We got a we're gonna add some more to this side over here in a minute. Put this dark color in here for now. I haven't been to Florida in a long time. It was kind of interesting to see how different it is about walking on dunes. You're not allowed to walk on the dunes. And can't get access to the beach unless you have a condo. That sucks. All right. Now we'll get a start. The sound is like poof, the way it went. I don't know what happened. Alright. So let's mix up some colors for some vegetation. I'll tell you what, let's do some. Let's get some linseed oil. On my brush. So we'll just put this on a script liner. Kind of thin it out here. This dark sand is so old, it's pretty, pretty thick. We'll see how it does. We'll see how it does. I'm just kind of flicking the brush here. All right. 
Hey, Rosalie. <laughs> I don't want to do that. <laughs> Then let's see, let's take a couple, I'll tell you what, let's do this. Let's get a couple darker ones. And I'll tell you what, let's, no, let's not do that first. Let's do this first. I'm going to cover up all that. I'm just looking at my brush every so often to see if that's kind of what I want the color. I think we'll have like a walk right there, here, so we won't do too much with that yet. We'll see. up just a little bit above that darker color out on the edge. Alright. And then let's go. Let's see. I'm just putting a little linseed oil out here on the side. And I think we'll clean the brush. I wasn't going to clean the brush, but I think I will clean the brush. How are you doing, Rosalie? Set that aside for a second. I got a couple ideas here. I think I'll try. Let's take, let's get some yellow ochre. And then we'll try it straight up first and see how that does. We'll see, we'll see. Let's start with a little bit of linseed oil to it, just to make it stick. Rosalie. I just, I've never tried to paint something like this. I just wasn't sure when I started where I was going to go with it, but since I just came home from the beach, I thought I should at least try to paint something like the beach. All right, let's see. Let's get some, let's use some titanium white, straight titanium white. A little bit of linseed oil. I have to I'm thinning this pretty thin because it's got to go over the top of all this other paint. Ugh. The thing is, this script liner is not rolling out right. Come on. All right, let's try this. How stupid is that? Yep. 
Too much, too much paint pollution. Let's try it again. That's not going to work, so let's try something different. Switching, switching piles of paint. Managed to pollute that one pretty good. Let's try some. Let's try this a little bit different. smooth that bottom out a little bit. Let's take some of this and let's take some cad yellow and some titanium white. Let's add a little more color in here. Suit me here eventually. Mm -hmm. We're gonna add a little paint thinner to our brush instead of instead of um, let's see. Change back to the one inch brush. Put a few highlights in here. Start working on. Start working the beach a little bit. Thank you, Susanna. That's okay, Rosalie. I know you're out there. All right, so let's see. Let's get some. Uh, what do I want to use? I guess I use a filbert. I just want to use a filbert because it's going to be. 
I'm gonna get control, I'll have control of this. I'll just paint to be fairly thin. Not too worried about those reeds right there. We'll put them back in a minute. Let's scrub it in some color here. some titanium white on my knife. I'm going to give the impression that there's a little bit of water coming up on the sand. And then let's see where we want to go with this. Let's take, let's put, let's put a rock on the beach. Why not, why not? Maybe a couple. Push the path over just a little bit. All right, I'm gonna do some final. Thank you, Elaine. We're just kind of peeling around today. I want to get back in the saddle. I've been gone for a couple of weeks to Florida. Can you tell? I'm gonna pull my hint. I don't know. I think I kind of like that. I'll tell you what. Never mind for that part. So let's put, let's see, let me find another grip line out here. No, no. Can never have too many paintbrushes, but I think I do. Alright, so let's see. So let's just put like a couple little birds up here. This final little touch, maybe right here. I think maybe on these reeds up here, if I can make this go, let's see if I can. Let's see if we can make this do what we want it to do. Let's add a little bit of extra highlight on here to these guys. Yeah, just a little, just a little, just a little. And these will just highlight like on the stem. There we go. 
And let's add a little bit of extra shadow. It's okay, Kelly Lee. You can watch it whenever you want to. It'll be up there. It'll be up there for you. All right, there you go. All right, guys. I think we call that. I think we'll call that done for today. Be sure you watch uh, Emily Jean on the Little Painter Girl channel. Anthony Gray on his uh, Central New York Acrylic channel. Those guys are fantastic artists. Anyway, we'll be back. Uh, we'll be broadcasting on Wednesdays and maybe Sunday afternoons from now on till springtime. So uh, if you have any questions, please leave them. Questions, comments, whatever. Uh, you know, see, I said, talk to you, I thought of something else I want to do. Let's do, that's what I get in my top. You know, I don't want to be like, Bob Ross said, don't piddle. You could piddle. You could paint another painting by the time you finish piddling, but I'm just going to add a couple of extra doodads in there. There we go. All right, that's it. Thanks, guys, for tuning in, and we will see you next time. If you have something in particular you'd like to see painted, drop me a note. I'll, I'll, I'll give it a spin if I think I can do it. Have a good one.